Okay, in this tutorial I will show you how to get your own source SDK and how to set it up right. Now with source SDK, if you don't know what it is, it's a program you use to map uh, for like CSS or other games, TF2, Half-Life 2, Deathmatch and so on. So what you're going to do is you take up your Steam and you go into Tools, remember Tools. Don't download it from like Google or something or the Pirate Bay whatever. It just then you have to do a lot of settings and so on. If you download it from tools, you get everything done immediately. You just need to change some things, maybe. Uh, also, make sure it's source SDK and not source SDK base. You gotta download source SDK. Uh, then you just start it up. You will then get a window that looks like this. It's source SDK, it says. Um, Hammer editor is the mapping thing. The other guy, the other things I just don't know. Model viewer, you say uh, look at all the props and so on in that you got in Source SDK. Face poster, I don't really know. Create a mod, had never tried it. Uh, in the description, you will find what games are for Half-Life 2 Episode 1 and what games are for the orange box. Uh, yeah, I will make a list. If uh, yeah, I only got TF2 for the orange box. But I'm gonna make settings for CSS, which is yeah, all my tutorials are about CSS. So you just take up Half-Life 2 Episode 1, and then you see here uh, you need to change here to like uh, contract source. Yeah, it will take some time to load when you press something new. Then you. <coughs> Here, then you uh, double click on Hammer Editor. You can close this down, but I uh, sometimes the Hammer Editor just fucks up, and you need to restart it. Then you should have this one up, so it's easier for you to upload it again. Uh, okay, so what you're gonna do now to get everything started, you should take File New. It will now look like this. Now here you can change if you want. Like this is the camera view. So you see everything you do in here. Here is the top view, and yeah, it says camera here. You should change the camera to shaded texture polygons. Okay, the hair should be the top x y. Make sure you got one of each because I had one front. When I when I started the map, I had two fronts, so it was a bit problem for me to map. So make sure you have one of each. You can see it's the only three top front side. You want it to be front. And this wants to be side, okay? So that's how I do that. And now uh, uh, you can go into when you're gonna rotate stuff. Uh, yeah, you can watch my tutorial. What is rotating? You can, it's quite hard to rotate. So I think you should do like this. Uh, you go into the tools, options, to the views, and pick uh, put it in this. 15 degree rotation. Uh, if you want to rotate like just a little bit, you should take away this cross. Also, 3D views. Uh, here you can take uh, the camera speed. Uh, yeah, how much you go fo forward. I have it like 219 something. So, yeah, that's how you do that. And yeah, that's pretty much it, how you set it up. Also, uh, you should have this one filled in. This one can also be filled in. I don't know what this one does, but have it filled in. Okay, so yeah, that's how you do that. Also, just so you know, you can drag these boxes. Wait, if you take it from the side, you can drag them around, place them wherever you want. Yeah. Yeah, I could place them up here too, but since I'm doing tutorials, I want to have everything here. And also in this side, you can you can drag them out. You can do like that. You can drag them out, put them in. Sometimes it will get fucked up when you start it because everything will be out here. Then just put it in. So yeah, that's how you set up your Source SDK. Also watch the tutorial in how to make a first map. Thank you for watching this tutorial.